am so glad to see all of you today. My name is Dom and I am the elementary director here at Lexington. And it is my favorite time of the week, worship time. Did you know that God loves us so much that he sent us Jesus? It's true, we can always trust God because Jesus is the best friend ever. Jesus is the best. God sent us Jesus because he loves us. What a big reason to trust God. In fact, the Bible teaches us that I can trust in God. I am not afraid. Psalm 56, 11. Awesome, great job. You can trust in God. Who can trust in God? I can trust in God, that's right. Well, today we're gonna to be hearing a fun story about how we can trust God from Ollie and his friends. Before that, I see you out there getting ready to get up, get on your feet and shake it out to worship. Let's stand up and dance for worship. A one, two, one, two, three, four. Yes, I have a friend who makes me feel like I smile, the reason for this song. He knows me, he loves me, when I mess up, he forgives me. I love to sing and celebrate and shout out Sing along with all you got. Here we go. I can love my neighbor because Jesus loves me. I can change the world because Jesus loves me. Sing it again. I can love my neighbor because Jesus loves me. I can change the world because Jesus loves me. gave us this music player for the clubhouse. Melody? Good morning. 
Can you please play us some marching music? Playing marching music? How cool is that? I love marching music, so I bought these rhythm sticks to keep time. Can you use your hands and clap along with me? Hands up. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's great. Now let's go slow. One, two, three, four. Now let's go super fast. One and a two and a three and a four and a one and a two and a three and a four. Woof, you guys did great. You can put your hands down now. This marching music is so much fun. Sometimes I imagine what it would be like to lead a real marching band. Wow, how amazing would that be? Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? Marching around in time, are you? I sure am, Ollie. I love marching music so much. Marching is lots of fun. Who? Who? So I've got a marching story for you. Listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Hola, friends. I'm Luis the Handyman. And look what I've got today. It's a ram's horn. It's like a trumpet for our story. And boy, is it a story. Do you want to help me build it? <laughs> Great. Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Today's true story from the Bible begins with a guy named Joshua. Now, Joshua was the leader of God's army. One day, God told Joshua that he was going to take the city of Jericho. Except, look, the city of Jericho had a huge wall that went all the way around it. It was big, it was strong, and the city was very hard to get into. I don't understand. How can Joshua and his army take the city if there's a huge wall around it? But Joshua trusted that God's plan would work. God told Joshua to take horns like this and march around the big wall blowing trumpets one time a day for six days. What? Blow trumpets and march? <laughs> Joshua didn't understand how God's plan would work, but Joshua trusted God anyway. <laughs> So, Joshua gathered his army and got ready to march around the big wall. Everyone, stand up. Now, get ready to march in place and blow your pretend trumpets. Ready, go. March, 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 march. They march on day one. They march on day two. Day three. Day four. Day five. Day six. And then stop. That was awesome marching. You can sit down now. Great job. <laughs> On day seven, God said, I want you to march around the wall seven times. Then when Joshua says go, give a loud shout. Okay, but not until Joshua says go. So Joshua still didn't understand. How would shouting and trumpets break down a wall? But 
Joshua trusted God. So they started marching around the city. Ooh, can you count with me? They marched around the city. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then Joshua said, go. Everybody shout. And the wall came down. They won. Great job, everyone. Woohoo! Wow, God is amazing. Sometimes we may not understand how God's plan will work, but we can trust God. Hey there, Ali. Tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story. And it's all true. Joshua trusted God's plan. So he went for a long march. Ho! Ho! Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Ho! Ho! Wow! Joshua trusted God's plan and marched around the walls, and they fell down. I can trust God's plan, too. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Maybe God has a plan for me to lead a marching band sometime. I better keep practicing. Melody, play another march, please. Playing marching music. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. God, I am not afraid. Psalm 5611. I trust in God. I am not afraid. Psalm 5611. That was an amazing story. I wouldn't know what to do if I was Joshua. First, there's this big wall, then God's like, no, no, no. Use your trumpets and march around it. I don't know about you guys, but I would get tired after finishing the first lap. But that's the amazing thing. We can trust in God because we know that He will work all things for good. Well, I had a great time with you all this week, and I can't wait to see you next week. One more time, let's say our bottom line. Who can trust in God? I can trust in God. That's right. I will see you next time, friends. <laughs>